Now kids, at what point do you think a game, YouTuber or person is very popular? In my opinion, there's three points. One, you must have a million followers on Twitter, Instagram or YouTube, I don't care. Second, you must have at least one person willing to die for you. Yeah? And third, people will try to leech off your success to launch their own games. And unfortunately, that does happen quite a lot with uh, our little friend Minecraft here. Now, I do realize that a whole lot of all other games have this issue, you know, where somebody just nabs the game and steals it. But I'm mostly going to be focusing on Minecraft because it is honestly like the most pathetic thieves or plagiarizers as a fancy word for that. So, um, we have a few main offenders, you know, a few people that really have broken, you know, the limit. You know, two of them have, one of them is just a joke. The first one is something called, uh, what is it even called? Okay, so it's called Worldcraft. But n not Worldcraft with a C, but with a K. So it's Worldcraft. It's Worldcraft. So what these games usually do is on their, like, you know, main channel or, like, game, like, page or whatever that is, they will add, like, actual gameplay of the game. But then on the actual advertisements, it's literally just, they just nab like Minecraft footage and be like, yo, this is our game, play. And it's like so dumb how just YouTube and Google in general just lets those ads slip right through. Like, I know for a fact everybody on Google knows exactly what Minecraft is, okay? I know for a fucking fact. Anyways, yeah, um... We've all just clicked on a video and the ad on the video was just like Minecraft for this. Literally nothing else, but the game was not Minecraft. It just do be like that, man. Now, the reason this is extra scummy and why I put it before the other ones is unlike, you know, the other ones on this list. Like, you know, the other ones at least try to not get sued. You know, they'll add like a button somewhere that just, you know, changes your perspective instead of like going to settings because that's a really long process. Or like add some new blocks or like add a new feature. This game literally just took the files from Minecraft, added a resource pack, you know, if you don't know, a resource pack is something that just changes how everything looks and like the sounds and the particles or whatever, but then goes and just sells it, just gives it. I'm pretty sure it's like no ads and free, you know, it's basically for people that don't want to like download Minecraft illegally, but I don't know, it still sounds, it still feels pretty illegal to me at least. But, 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 the thing is, I'm pretty sure, since they have changed how the game looks, they can't get sued. I don't know. Now, the next game on this list is actually kind of popular game, you know. A lot of people play it, my cousin used to play it. It's, I would say it's a fun game, like you could get into it. Because it has quite a few features, but you can't say it's not a copy of Minecraft. Actually, it's like, it's like, you know how, it, like, imagine Roblox in Minecraft had a child, okay? And that child has, like, the bad features of Roblox and the fa bad features of Minecraft just combined together. Yeah, that's, that's what this game is. Like, I'm not trying to roast it too hard, but it ain't damn good. It just ain't good.
You know what? I take back everything I said. The game is not a combination of Roblox and Minecraft. Roblox, Minecraft, and Clash of Clans. Not actually no. Boom Beach. Yeah, Bo you guys remember Boom Beach? Yeah, yeah. They had a fucking threesome, and this abomination of a thing just came out. I I don't know, man. It's kind of scary. Like it looks really like honestly the fact that you know it has like a little system I feel like as you know you know Minecraft since I, I don't think it was supposed to be like that but since Microsoft bought it it was really just kind of for children like not for children but the age demographic you know the uh, targeted the age demographic was children and I feel like you know children like not three year olds maybe like six five year olds you know this game is probably for like toddlers you know like two years old three years old like it tells you how to do everything okay you see this it glows you just gotta click on it you know it's just easy like i was playing minecraft for almost a year like i was on pocket edition so you know i didn't know too much you know as a little child for like a year before you know i was watching the ntdm video and realized you need to like press on the button you run with twice to sprint i don't know man it's really weird anyways yeah that's kind of it for that game <laughs> you know actually funny thing is uh while i was uh, like taking uh, that video that i just sh showed you you know of uh, blocks 3d or blockcraft 3d something like that I literally got the ad of uh, of like World Kraft. I kid you not. You know the ad that I put earlier on? Yeah, that is literally it. I literally just got it. It is every fucking where. Now, we can all agree on one thing. Communism is not good. Is it? Nah. <laughs> in a row, god damn it. Anyways, uh, enough of that cringe. No, you're cringy. Shut up, you're a doll. Anyways, enough of that cringe. Uh, the one we're gonna be looking at is this. Oh yes, me comrades. Finally. After years of everybody only supporting the disgusting evil left leptards, those disgusting leptards, finally us real Slavs finally get some recognition. Finally, Minecraft, bad, our craft, good. That was that cringe. Yeah, oh my god, that guy was pathetic. Anyways, <laughs> it is the fun. I'm pretty sure that's a joke. I reckon he's doing it for the joke because it was always like, oh, Minecraft, ho ho, Stalin, very sad, Karl Marx, sad, but our craft. Yes, comrade. Very good. Very goddamn good. Uh, this is a fucking toy game. What the fuck am I? I'm seven years old. Haha, <laughs> yes, you are. Shut up. Oh, like, what, what do I do now? Yeah, I kind of get that's it. Now, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, you can go ahead and like it, maybe. Uh, if you didn't enjoy this video, you can go ahead and dislike and comment on why you didn't enjoy this video. But, please.
please don't do that. My ego is fragile. Do you understand? So, uh, yeah, you can also, you know, like this video if you enjoyed it. And you can go ahead and watch some other of my videos. I make these videos quite often. Uh, if you enjoy all of my videos and you don't want to miss any new ones, you can go ahead and subscribe or uh, press on the little, like, thing, be like, bell that comes up. I don't know. That's supposed to give you notifications, but it doesn't, so it doesn't matter if you click or not. Um, oh, yeah, right. Uh, I have a subreddit. You can join it. I know why I act like there is something here, because there isn't. I'm just going to edit it in later. Wait, do you think somebody actually ever thought, like he was watching a YouTuber, and he just thought that, he just like thought that somebody was like, really like having some floating screen? That's weird. Anyways, yeah, uh, I'll see ya.